Hello, everybody. Hello, everyone. <sighs> it's time for the stream Good to start. To see it's time for another harvest stream. And thank you all for the compliments on Clouded Moon. I'm on Cloud Nine. Ha. Cl Clouded Moon Nine. <laughs> Good, good stuff. Now, I feel like... Hold on, something just happened. Oh, okay. Nothing important happened. Okay. Steam was like, you got a new thing in your inventory. And I'm like, oh, did somebody just gift us another game? <laughs> no. Right at the beginning of the stream. I mean, it happens yeah. sometimes. But no, that didn't happen. Uh, what happened is I got, like, a trading card. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh, can I turn off these notifications? Well, uh, thank goodness we've got flower harvest today. Otherwise, you'd be obsessing about Cloud and Moon all day? I mean, I will be anyway, mm -hmm. but video games are an excellent distraction. <laughs> yes. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and jump over. Oh, well, hold on. There we go. Perfect. <sighs> yes. It is the Flower Harvest, where we play a bunch of random games from our game collection that you guys get to vote on. So... Patrons voted on our first game. Yeah, so how it worked and is... Hollow you Knight swept the board. Uh, yeah, so what happened is, uh, for the first votes, we've decided that I will choose a game, it's Neil will choose a game, and then we'll put three other random games on there, and patrons get to vote on it. And uh, my choice this time was Hollow Knight, and it won by an absolute landslide. Yeah. So, uh... Like, it just pulverized the competition. So, we're playing Hollow Knight, which uh, was gifted to us a while ago, and I, we've not had the chance to play it yet. So that's why I picked it. Ah. And I'm just bonking everything, because there's 700 wires! Oh, God. Oh, I thought you said that you got the PS3 controller hooked up to it. Oh, PlayStation 4, sorry. Okay. That's what I meant, the PlayStation 4. All right, so we're we're playing Hollow Knight, and... Oh, uh, no. Oh, God, why? You were working. You were working earlier. Why did you turn off? No. Controller's not dead, is it? No, it shouldn't be. It should be charging. Okay, come on. Seems to be turning back on, maybe. It did a brief little yellow flash. Yeah, I saw that. How'd you get it to work before? I just plugged it in. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Professional streamers, you guys. Yep. Help. Why? Yeah, I know very little about this game other than everybody loves it. Okay, hold on. Is it because I closed Steam? Did that do it? Was that why? I can't imagine that's why. Alright, um... Okay. It seems to be working. Oh. oh, there you go. I think I wasn't clicked on the game. Oh. Yeah, let, let me check that quick. Yeah, there we go. That's what was <laughs> happening. I wasn't clicked. Okay. Again, I've not done a lot of PC gaming, so... They put bugs in him. I feel like that is very appropriate for this game. All I know is it's something to do with bugs. It's a side-scrolly platformer style game, Super Metroid. But it's yeah. bugs, says Kazuyoshi. So, uh, let's go ahead and get Metroidvania. started, and I am the one playing. Oh. Well, that, that's, that's what I want. That's the perfect size. Then hit done. I like how it's just like, adjust to what you want. Alright, let's, let's jump in. Oh, timer? Uh, uh yeah. In Wilds Beyond, they speak your name with reverence and regret for none who could tame our savage souls yet, yet you the challenge met. Okay. 
Under palest watch you taught, we changed base instincts were redeemed. A world you gave us to bug and beast as they have never dreamed. From Elegy of Hallowness, a Menominon the Teacher. <laughs> Something like Menominon. that. Menominon! Do, 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 do. Oh, that seems bad. Also, if at any time it sounds too loud, just let me know and I can turn it down. What? Oh my god, one like clockwork! Coming back in with ten more gift subs! Holy cow, where's my mouse? Help. I lost my mouse. Well, uh, we'll check what those are in just a moment. <laughs> Thank you, One Night Clockwork. That's us. We're that cute little bug guy. We're adorable. Biff. Okay. Let's let's read those gifts now. All right. So, one like clockwork came in and gifted ten gift subs to Fenicite, Willow Step, Blue Gem, the bunch of numbers, Cryptid Crocota, uh, Spotty Cat, Dawn Scar. Maybelline, uh, Uncool Potatoes, Scorpion Teeth, and Squishm. <laughs> Thank you, One Light Clockwork. Thank you, One Light Clockwork. That is amazing. Thank you, as always. All right. Anyways. Ooh. Ooh, that's quite the jump. Learning controls. So looking at this game, it definitely looks like it's more um like like this game's actually sprite based. Rather than 3D models. Yes. Love to see that. Oh, I thought you could collect those bugs. What bugs? The the butterfly moth thingies. Oh, I didn't even notice those. How do you not notice them? They're glowing. Give me all the bug monies. I can only assume. Can I do like a wall jump? I don't I don't think wall jump is a thing. Okay. Platforming. Ooh, I like the little dust trails and stuff. Mm-hmm. Ah! Screw you. Was this? Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Your great strength marks you amongst us. Focus your soul and you shall achieve feats of which others can only dream. Collect soul by striking enemies. Once enough soul is collected, hold circle to focus soul and heal. Is that... Ah, okay, so that's the... The healy button? The... Yeah, that's the Healy button, but it's also the bubbly, the bubbly do up in my health meter thing. Ah! Ah! <gasps> you got hit! Oh, you got, I got hit, hit again. again! Okay. Okay. It only heals back one hit each. Yeah. Hello? Oh God. Spikies. Got it. All right, all right. What? 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 How'd you take damage from that? Um, I think a stalactite might have fallen. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, me too. But that's that's what I'm presuming happened. I'm guessing you don't take any kind of fall damage, correct? 
Uh, not that I've noticed so far. Ah! God, that was another stalagmite tight. Oh, the little bugs. Get that soul back. Oh, they gave you temporary health. Oh. Nice. Neat. Okay. No follow damage, thankfully, but it does take a moment to get up. So you have like a stagger, I'm guessing, if you fall from too far. Whoa! Oh! Eh, I can't oh. get up there. And there's money, I think, or the collectible. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Let me back out. Oh, you could jump back down to get that money. If no. only. Alright. Oh! Oh! Oh wait, it's not instant death. It's just start over from where you were. Yeah. Is that... Is this the oh, thing? Ho, ho, it is. secret! Oh, come on. Don't make all my money go into the the, the spiky doos. Oh. I was oh. about to say, can you get back up there? But you can. I, I, one thing I do know about this game is it's hard. Uh, well, yeah, it's a Metroidvania. Hello? Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Beyond this point, you may enter the land of king and creator. Step across this threshold and obey our laws. Bear witness to the last and only civilization, the eternal kingdom, Hollow Nest. Hollow Nest? Let me in! Screw you, door! Oh yeah, I need to remember I can attack up. Yeah, that's probably really Oh, I handy. can also attack down. Knock, knock! Ooh. Well, jump, Jelly I ho. guess. Ow. Yeah. Great city you got here. <laughs> Be a shame if I cut all your grass. Dirt mouth. The fading town. Hello. Oh, oh, traveler. I'm afraid there was only me left to offer welcome. Our town's fallen quiet, you see. The other residents, they've all disappeared. Headed down that well, one by one, into the caverns below. Used to be there was a great kingdom beneath our town. It's long felt a ruin, yet it still draws folks into its depths. Wealth, glory, enlightenment, that darkness seems to promise all things. I'm sure you too seek your dreams down there. Well, watch out. It's a sticky, it's a sickly air that fills the place. Creatures turn mad and travelers are robbed of their memories. Perhaps dreams aren't such great things after all. Hmm... Also, please no spoilers. Yes. Oh, oh, you heal? Yeah. Wonderful. But it did take away our temporary health. Mmm, that stinks. For all your mapping supplies, we will be open soon. Zelda and Cornifer. Okay. Ah! Down uh, the well you go. I meant to jump over it, but then I didn't. I... I don't think I can Forgotten go back up. Crossroads. Well, obviously, I should go left. Because the correct answer is always right, which means the real correct answer is left, then right. Oh, look at that one bug. He's got a weird, drippy nose. He's dead now. Yeah. But he ain't hurting you. Especially now because he's dead. <laughs> you should make friends. 
No, enemies only. Yes, can I... I can't... I don't know how to Are talk. Are these all like little homes? Like little, little bug nests? Kind of looks that way. I guess she can't talk to him right now. Hmm. Just sad larva man. Stay away from me. Don't touch me. I am fragile. Who? Yep. Maybe he is perhaps a hollow shell of a knight. Ha! The Pilgrim's Way. Travelers of Hollowness descend through verdant wilds and fungal groves to the city at this kingdom's heart. There all wish shall there all wishes shall be granted, all truths revealed. Ah. Oh, hi you. Okay. I I have a feeling I don't have what I need to take this guy out, so I'm going to leave. That music. Oh god. Woo! Hi. Down you go. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I can't jump through these platforms. Good to know. Flat. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> yeah. I'm guessing you can't, like, jump on the enemies. Like, you did a down attack. But, like, you probably can't just land on them. I... That's probably bad. Oh! Oh, he charged you. Stay back, sir. Did she hear, like, a mama? what it kind of sounded like. Give me the oh, bits. Oh, all their little bug corpses. Oh. Oh. Bobby. Oh. You can't get up there yet. You need like a an air dash. Yeah. I know there are more skills that I unlock in this game. I just have not found them. And if it's a Metroidvania, I will need to find them. Yeah. So... I have this sudden thought. Mm -hmm. That thing looks vaguely like the crying thing. Oh, you I've... think you need to like 101 Dalmatians this shit? Yeah, sure. Or my my, mother my my. Yeah. Whoa. Why does everybody want to attack me? I mean, it probably ah! has nothing to do with the fa- Ow, ow, oh. oh. Okay, I did get him once there, but then he hit me, but I can heal. Because I have full goo. Do you have any kind of map? No. Okay, because I was going to say, if you can make like a note of where that caterpillar guy was, then we can come back and get him whenever you get the skill. Because hell if I'm remembering where we've been. <laughs> Ow. 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 I'm good at games. Ah. Ah. Definitely looks like I can go down there. <laughs> You're ruthless. Wee! Oh, I could have gone the other way too. Yeah. Oh, you could actually go back up this time. Oh, Metroidvanias. What is the correct way to go? Who knows? I've never really played Metroidvanias, so these uh, maps always overwhelm me. Looking at them, I'm like this is in. How do you remember where to go? This is very open. I just gotta say, ow, sir. Please. I only have so many juices. 
I mean, you can get more. I know. Every time I hit these guys, I get more. Get him! Like, this is one of those games where I probably went the wrong way to start with, which means that I've missed out on, like, a very useful power-up I could have gotten immediately. Eh, you don't know that. I'm sure the game is... Temple of the Black Egg. Designed well to, uh, help players like you. Hello there! How delightful to meet another traveler on these forgotten roads. You're a short one, but you've a strong look about you. I'm Quirrell. I have something of an obsession with uncharted places. This ancient kingdom holds many fascinating mysteries, and one of the most intriguing of them is standing right before us. A great stone egg lying in the corpse of an ancient kingdom. And this egg... Is it warm? It certainly gives off a unique air. Mm. Can it be opened? There are strange marks all over it. I do so love a mystery. And who knows what other marvels lie even deeper below us. Is it a clue to something? Mm. Because it's got different patterns on it. So there's the one with the circle there, the alien face below, and then the uh, other alien face with four eyes. You are correct. For so long, I've, I've felt drawn here. So many tales full of wonders and horrors. No longer could I resist. I just had to see for myself. And what a time I chose to arrive. This dead world has sprung to life. The creatures are riled up and the earth rumbles. The air is thick. I wonder what could have brought it all about. It's just, if there is ever an archaeologist looking at something in a video game, you go, oh... That's a puzzle, I should remember. That's the answer to a puzzle. Am smart, oh. gamer! Oh my god. I, okay, I flipped back around. Oh. Well, look at you. Oh, I can go back up. I can go back up now. Um, there's a lot of, like, bones and stuff. A stone door with a simple lock. Hmm. Oh, no, I didn't mean to check that again. So you All need right. a key. Well, that, that's it. Back down you go. Wah. Unless... Unless? Is this place open yet? No. no. Okay. Goodbye, dirt, dirt myth. I have a feeling something else needs to happen before uh, that's going to be a thing. Like, something more Ow. significant than oh, you God. Ah. wandering around a few rooms. I missed my bits. Get the bits. It makes like a jingling sound, so it makes me think it's definitely money or something like it. It's definitely currency of some kind. Screw all your shit. <laughs> the way he swings his sword around too while you're walking, it makes me feel like I'm a kid again and you just get like a big stick and you're just like walking and Beheading swinging it as fast as you can to get that whooshing sound. Oh. Ah! Oh! Oh god. Okay, but you could definitely deal with this guy. Oh. Or I could die. <laughs> I was I was wondering how long it takes to heal. Uh, longer than Too I. Too long. Okay. Talk to the guy. Did, Did you, you visit, visit that, that temple? A strange building, I've heard. Though I'd never dare to journey myself. The braver among us once went there to pray. They said said they felt peace within the walls. After a while, they stopped going. I wonder what changed. Okay. Um. I'm dead. That's what happened. No, no, I didn't check it. Wait, my Healy gauge is broken. <gasps> oh, it broke it. Does that just mean it's empty? Maybe. Okay, well, it's filling back up. Can it, like, spill? 
now because it's busted? I don't know. Oh. I lost all my monies. <gasps> oh. Oh. Oh, please tell me this is like a, a Souls game where I can go back. And oh, well, that would make sense if you're like a little hollow bug. You just go back to your, your hollow little body. Go back to where I died and get my souls back, essentially. I mean, okay. I know very little about this game, but... And I know very little about Dark Souls, uh, but I have heard numerous times this be called, like... The 2D Dark Souls yeah. or some shit like that. I mean, granted, people say that about a lot of things. Oh. I kill myself. Oh, yes, uh, I get all my bits back. Wonderful. Good. Wonderful. Ah! Oh, God. That did two damage, by the way. Two damage? Yeah. Oh! Ah! Fudger knuckers. <laughs> this is the Dark Soul of Dark Souls comparisons to Dark Souls. Awesome. <sighs> I would like a dash or a run or anything. You gotta get good before you deserve those. Silly. Am I not good? No. <laughs> I'm the best! I'm getting hit by basic enemies! That means I'm a gamer! <laughs> now I wonder what happens if you die before you collect... Like... My bits again? Yourself. Yeah, it's like, does your thing just become more broken, or... I have a like... feeling it goes away if it's anything like Dark Souls. Like your old body goes away and yeah. the new one replaces it. Yeah. Like but it I... would just wouldn't continually punish you for being bad. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Hiya! Oh. It's back in the same spot, thank god. Okay. Ah! Ah! Ha! Ow! Ouch! Okay, okay. A dash would really be helpful ugh, in a fight like this. Oh, you got Ooh, it! Ooh, it looks okay, like there were some old... big monies. Oh wait, you did get your body back. <sighs> I missed that part. <sighs> Good. I Cute. did it. I freed the buggo. Ha <laughs> ha Screw you! <laughs> Just want to say Cloud Moon was fantastic. Glad Thank to hear Thank you. It. Thank you so much. We're really excited about just everything. Now... Chapter 2 is already coming along pretty well. Real question. Do I go back... Mm -hmm. Do I go back over there? To the crying bug? Yeah. Maybe? <sighs> Probably? I want to see what it's about, so I'm going to go that way. Yeah. Even though there's more to explore this direction. I mean, I don't think there's a... And this is a Metroidvania, like... There is technically a... not a wrong a, way to go. Well, there is technically a more, a more right way where more stuff will happen, but... Whatever, we'll keep going. I would like to find out how to spend all my bits so that I, 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 I can use them and not just be dying all the time. Ha! I would not say I am bad at these kind of games, it's just I've not played a lot of these kind of games. So there's another one up there, but I cannot reach it. Yeah. Unless I'm amazing! Haha! <laughs> -ha. Uh. Was it more up? I, oh, wait, no, there's just extra money bits on that spot. 
Okay. I have no idea where You can spend your bets on your favorite Twitch streamers? Well, that is true. <laughs> That's how you use your bits. Alright. There is a slight knockback to the attack! That you have to keep a account of? Yep. So you can't just stand in one spot and whammy. And often, if you are in the air, you get bounced around even more from hitting things. Makes sense. But it's only a bounce back when you hit people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. Hello. Oh, uh, hey. Ah. Cute. Adorable. Okay. It is a puppy's quest. So. Ah. Ow. I believe that this is where the question of if you found a man in a jar, would you free him came from. I think, I think. If that, you found a life-size man in a jar, would you free him? Yeah. Hello, sir. Um, hello, uh, hello there. Uh, come down to explore these beautiful old ruins. Don't mind me. I have a fondness for exploring myself. Getting lost and finding your way again is a pleasure like no other. We're exquisitely lucky, you and I. I'm a cartographer by trade, and I'm working on mapping this area right now. Would you like to buy a copy of my work so far? Purchase a map? Yes, please. A map would be wonderful. Hold L1 to view the map. View detailed map of Hollow Nest on the map pane of the inventory. Map can be a useful thing, but it... But alone it won't show you where you are. If you're not the head for directions, I suggest purchasing a compass from my wife, uh, is mm. Zelda. She is just now opening our new map shop in Dirtmouth, selling all sorts of useful things to wanderers like yourself. She'll even sell you some of my old maps from time to time. I pop back to see her whenever I finish mapping an area. She's always so excited to see me. We don't get to hang out much. Okay. Cool. So you are... In the bug guy room. Oh, I think him. it shows all the rooms that I have explored. Yeah. No, not all of it. It doesn't show all the rooms I've explored. Because uh, up here, top left, is where we met the caterpillar people. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh. Okay. Da. Be careful that wants you to bonk your head. I think the last game I played that would be similar to this was Ori, Ori in the Blind Forest. Yes, which yeah. I mean, when I was playing that, people are like, "Ooh, you might like this too." Yeah. Okay, these are in invincible beasties for right now. <laughs> Uh, okay, no. Mm. You just don't got mad jumps, dog. I don't. I don't got the mad jumps. Oh, that water is bad. Ah. It's pooping babies. Hate Ooh. it when they do that. Ooh. Ooh, it 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 it's hissed. It's sizzle. Ah! <laughs> I feel such genuine fear. <laughs> yeah, I believe Adam Savadan, when he was playing this game, he was not re releasing the bugs. Oh. Like, he just refused to do it as, like, a troll move. <laughs> oh, oh, that's our timer. That's the timer, okay. 
That's our timer. Have we played the sequel to Ori and the Blind Forest? We have not. Yeah. But anyways, it came up to be a question of, if you found a man-sized, uh, a man in a man-sized jar out in the forest, would you release him? And it's a hotly debated topic whether you should or should not do that. Hotly debated. Every, the, the moral question of the century. The ethics of our time. Of course. Ooh. Because you don't know why they're in a jar in the first place. They could be evil. They could be an evil genie trying to trick you. Or they could be an innocent. But who, who put them in the jar? And do you want to piss off whoever put them in a jar? And even if you can hear them through the jar, can you believe anything that a man in a jar tells you? I found a secret. I, I know the timer has gone off, but I'm enjoying this. Which is unsurprising because this is a highly, is a critically acclaimed game. Yes, the man is alive. If he's dead, then it's not so much of a question. <laughs> then it's more just a question of, well, do you leave him there? <laughs> Wait, there's another one. There's... What if you can put them back into the jar? But you don't know. You don't know if you can put them back in the jar. Oh, I've wandered into a fight. I see. You've wandered into death, is what you've done. No, I'm not dead yet. And things have opened up. Okay, there's signs for something that direction. Too much <laughs> uncertainty, anxiety, go burr. <gasps> well, what if I killed the man and ah. took him out of the jar? Oh, healing spring? Yeah. Oh, yes, definitely. it is. And a seat. And I think that saves. Cool. Well, then, there you go. This there we go. Part. Perfect stop. 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 Spot to stop. Oh, look at the look at the, the binding of Isaac mouths spewing water. Ah! <sighs> okay. Well, this was fun. I enjoyed this. This was a good time. I guess they have little horns like our protagonist, too, so... They're little bug people. What if I killed the jar? I mean, <laughs> y'all are bringing up the questions of what would you do in that situation? Either way, that's going to be... Truly, this is a question for the likes of Socrates. Mm -hmm. uh, Tenille, you get to entertain the chat for a bit because I need to get the next flower harvest game set up. Yeah. Maybe you want to explain how this works? Oh, yes. Okay, so if you're new to Flower Harvest... Or if you uh, come back after a while... Yeah. Uh, what we're going to do now is randomize a list of the games that Sean and I own. All in one big randomizer. We pick out the top five. And then we will put those into a straw poll for you guys to vote on what we play next. I'm already excited. Uh, looking at the list. Um, you can vote in the straw poll. However, if there is a game you see on the list and you're like, no, you have to play this next, you can donate either 1,000 bits, which is uh, 10 real life dollars, to say, no, you're playing this next. Or you can use, was it 30,000? flower petals? Yes. 30,000 30, flower petals to just pick the next game. And then we'll be playing that game for the next half hour to 45 minutes. If we were to play this, what would we do? I don't know. We'll figure that out later. Okay. <laughs> That's the PS3, okay. Because we have that. Oh my god. Uh, 
I'll just not say anything. <laughs> All right, so. So, the options for the next games are Boulder's Gate 2 Enhanced Edition, Balloon Fight on the NES, Jack 3 for the PlayStation 2. On, but we'd be playing the HD version on the PS4. Yeah. Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix on the PS3. And Ghosts and Goblins for the NES on the Switch Online. Sean will have a picture of our options here in just a second. And the straw pull up a little bit after that. Oh shoot, you didn't work on the straw pull at the same time. No, I didn't. I, I realized. You know, it always takes a little bit to get back in the rhythm of this. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, here's the voting options. <sighs> <laughs> I, I'm gonna say I really am keeping my fingers crossed for Boulder's Gate 2. It's one of my favorite games of all time. You'd like that, wouldn't you? I would like that. It's a wonderful game. And it has a banger of a start. I'm just... And I want to make Sean play it. Oh. <laughs> I'm just hoping it's not one specific game. <laughs> All right. Now. Oops. No, it's here. There we go. Straw pull is up. And we'll give this a few minutes for people to vote. Let people choose. Not sure what we do if we play Kingdom Hearts. It could be a lot of different things. We like, could either do bosses or... Oh, you mean like... <laughs> or we could just play the beginning of the game. Play the beginning of the game or play organization battles. Mm -hmm. There are definitely options there. Yeah. Uh, it's currently a tied vote, so oh. <laughs> you guys have to make a decision. Some votes for Jack 3. Yeah. You've played Jack 1 and a little, and some amount of Jack 2. Mm-hmm. I've played the beginning of Jack 3 because I hated Jack 2. <laughs> and I'm just like, I really want to finish this trilogy, but I can't get through Jack 2. Reminds me of my cousin. He said he played Jack 1. Mm -hmm. It took him like a year. And then it took him two years to get through Jack 2. And then he got through Jack 3 in a week. <laughs> wow. I, I love the original Jack and Daxter. I can play it in like a day. But the rest of the franchise lost me. <laughs> All right. I think we're going to give it about another minute. It is still a close race between Kingdom Hearts and Baldur's Gate. So we'll give it a little bit more time for people to get in there and vote if they have not done so already. All right. Well, been about a minute, give or take, and not seeing any new votes. This is one of my favorite tracks in Hollow Knight. Mm. It is pretty nice. This is mm -hmm. a very nice song. All right. Well, that's going to call it, and uh, we're going to play some Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix for the PlayStation 3. All right. So when we come back... I guess we'll start a new game, probably? 
I don't know, we should see what files are even on the PS3. Mm, that's true, because it's the PlayStation 3 version as compared to the 4. Yeah. All right, well, we'll see you guys in a little bit. So we're going to take it over to the break screen, and we'll Be talk right back. to you after we get everything set up again.
Ah, back to some good old Kingdom Hearts. Mm-hmm. Kingdom Hearts 2, that is. Hell yeah. Another favorite game of all time. Shocking also, absolutely no one. I know. Also, what my clockwork is just subscribed for six months at tier two. Oh, I missed that part. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you so much for that tier two subscription. Yes, now you have the heart version of my screaming face. My goodness, thank you for that six month subscription. Wow. Let's see, we got a whole bunch of different save files here. Oh look, there's the level 99 file at the top where yeah. we were obviously trying to kill Lingering Will. Lingering Will. Yeah. Mm. Do we load any of these or do we just go into a new game? Uh, I think we should load a new game and maybe do something silly with it or something. I don't know. Critical? We that that could be the silly thing to do. Let's do it. Okay. I always forget to resub my prime sub on time, so you just did it for six months. That makes sense. <laughs> Go ahead and set that timer. Yes. Set a timer for 30 minutes. Okay, 30 minutes. Thank you. Now, we unfortunately can't really watch Sanctuary, yeah. can we? Skip it. No, absolutely we cannot watch it. Oh, I love it, though. It's good. But it will absolutely mute and copyright claim this whole VOD, and I do not want that. <laughs> uh, so how much of this are we going to actually watch? We should probably skip, just so that we actually play Get somewhere, some because there's a lot of cutscenes. Yeah. And if you're not aware of all the amazing cutscenes from this game, we did a full Let's Play of it. So now we're just going to try to beat our faces in on the hard stuff. Wee. Well, let's get this investigation underway. Yo, Roxas, never thought I'd see you do such a rotten thing. We didn't steal anything, all right? We didn't steal your shit. I'd like to believe you, but who else would steal that stuff? What stuff? As if you didn't know, hey, I'm not going to tell you. God success me, champ. Walk over there. Do it, coward. Do you will Go on, Roxas, ask her. Reaction commands. Oh, hello, Roxas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's you, Roxas. Don't let me down. You used to be one of my favorite customers. Used to be. I'm not a thief. It's not, it's no fun having everyone suspect me, you know. Then you gotta find a way to clear your name. The woman at the candy shop is pretty disappointed too. Roxas, <laughs> have you seen my cat around? Uh, Roxas is an assimilation, so... <laughs> Something's bugging out with the, the, the voice clips. <laughs> Thank you, Roxas. Did they steal something from you, too? Oh my, yes, something important. Just so you know, we didn't do it. I believe you. Thanks for that, ma'am. So what did they take from you? My shit. My precious shit. Looks like the culprit's going around and stealing shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... It, it's too easy to put anything in there. It is. And not just shit, but the word shit too. This isn't your average thief. I don't know, Pence, it seems like the bare minimum for a thief. They go around and they steal shit. 
I wonder if Cypher would know anything about this. We gotta talk to him. Come on, to the sandlot! <laughs> they had to save money by casting the same person for every character, and it seems they only know one voice. <laughs> uh... Diz didn't want to... Didn't want to put in the extra uh, money to hire more voice actors. Mm -hmm. Thieves. That was low, you know. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Nice comeback there, Blondie. What'd you say? You can give us shit back the... now. Yeah, you're the only ones who would take it, you know? That was undeniable proof that we totally owned you, lamers. So what did you do? Burn it? <laughs> Not that shit. we need some shit. to prove that you're losers. I'm trying to line it up with this so that it's more accurate for the audience. <laughs> now you're talking. <laughs> but it's a problem because it's a little off. I guess if you get on your knees and beg, maybe I'll let it slide. <laughs> Roxas. 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 How many of these cutscenes are we watching, by the way? Uh, you know, I just want to. <laughs> See, the undeniable proof that we own these lamers? Yeah, the undeniable proof that they totally owned you lamers. Okay, so magic, defense, or attack? Probably magic, right? In critical? Yeah. Yeah, probably. This'll do. Time to die! God. Focus. Time to die. Good luck, Tenille. Thanks. By the way, Tenille's the one playing. Yeah. I don't know if we covered that. Um. Come on. Quit playing around and fight. Neil, loser. Don't leave me hanging now. Isn't this romantic? Get hacked, Cypher. Huh. Cypher's not feeling so hot, you know? Tournament decides. What the fuck, man? Don't take my photo. <laughs> what was that? The, th All right. the thief? <laughs> Let's go fight them. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the PlayStation 3, where the load times are butt. Oh, yeah. Like, the load times in this in the Kingdom Hearts games are worse than the PS2 on the PlayStation 3. Yeah. Thankfully, they fix it for the PlayStation 4, but... It's really apparent when you do form changes. Yeah, like, when you change it just into sits a drive. And loads. We have come for you, my liege. Huh? Da, da, da. Whee! Don't die now. Ow. Don't die now.
It's no use. What? What? What is this thing? It seeks blood. <laughs> What's Ow! The, there's got to be a lock on button. There it is. Yeah. You did it. And we did it. We got the shit back. Yeah, we got all our shit back. Huzzah. Oh my god, the load times. Most of this is just going to be loading screens. <laughs> well, because there's a lot of cutscenes mm -hmm. in the beginning, so... Poor Roxas. Alright. Yeah, no, I know that. We can't change the controls yet. Yeah, the camera is definitely... Backwards? Yeah, inverted. I like how there's 99 files. And we have a few at the bottom. Yeah, I feel like those might have been my brother. Oh, yeah. Hurry up, Roxas! Dog fight! Hand me that popcorn. I want to consume popcorn. Alright. We're going to Market Street. Mmm, popcorn. Whoa. That sound effect came a lot sooner than we got the image. <laughs> Promise for a struggle. Time to make some money. Oh, or hell not. yeah. Or, or not. Yeah. Or not. <laughs> nope, the feet are just that big. I'm so good at this mini game, y'all. It was burned into my brain. Thanks, you're a big help. hill it looks like he's waiting at the station plaza he's not gonna do any work at all he's just gonna wait there there's skateboarding oh yes there is hell yeah there's skateboarding was this game made in 2006 oh you know i forgot to update the game on the stream I'm bad at that. There we go. We got sick moves. God, this kid's got some jumps. Hi, I just joined. Uh, I never seen this game before. What's it about? It's about hearts and darkness and love 
and, and friendship and friendship and stuff. You should check out our Let's Play. <laughs> and not just of this game, of, of all the games. Because jumping into this one will make you very confused. Because it is the third game in a series of like eight games. Yeah, ten. And unless you experience them in order, they don't make a lot of sense. And we love it. Mm-hmm. Hmm, this should cover expenses. Continue working? Nah, I've earned enough. All president accounted for? What do we got? So essentially what we're doing here is we're playing the game on the hardest difficulty and we're going to get our ashes handed to us. Well, if we get that far. Because it sounds like fun. Let's see. Just this. Good job. <laughs> you can go up here without collecting any money at all. Mm -hmm. We now have... Ta-da! 5,000 money. Sweet! Let's get tickets. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Money! And then some things happen, and we don't care. Well, we care, but we just care. not now. Yeah. Money, money, money. Must be funny in Diz's world. In a rich rock-ish world. <laughs> what are you supposed to do today? You'll see. All right. Hey. So, morning. Oh, that's perfectly normal. No more context needed. Yeah. <laughs> Things are broken. It's cool. I love I love the money pun as well. It's good. Wow, you're not even hitting them. Yeah, come on. Not good. Sean, are you eating more chocolate pretzels? No, sadly, those are gone. Yeah. I'm just eating popcorn now. Although we could make more. That is true. Use the keyblade. Hey, girl. Wait, why is it made from Final Fantasy here? <laughs> um, well, this is a game that's a crossover between Disney and Final Fantasy, so that's why. Yeah. It has a lot of original characters, but... Sometimes there's also background characters of Final Fantasy characters, and you go Disney. to a, go to a lot of Disney locations. Yeah. As the series has progressed, it's become less and less Final Fantasy stuff. Mm-hmm. But there's still some elements in there. Uh. Again, if you haven't checked it out, I highly suggest checking out our Let's Play. It's a fantastic series. Uh. Probably magic again, right? Yeah. Magic's really good in this game. Well, time to die. <laughs> yeah, basically. Things get hard for realsies now. On critical mode, enemies just do a ridiculous amount of damage to us. Ooh, ah! Like that. Heart. Whoa. 
Uh, also, I could be wrong, but I feel like the strats for Roxas are jump attacks. Because I feel like he attacks much faster in the air. Oh, yeah. Aerial Ooh. recovery! Good. Good. Now I feel like you can menu. Yeah, I can. Yay! All right. Oh, oh, not that. We do want the experience, but we do get a whole butt ton of abilities right off the bat for because playing we're on critical. critical. And a whole bunch of ability points as well, which you don't get in other abilities or other difficulties so in some ways it is easier to play through is it honestly the speed run of critical is easier than like the hard run a proud yeah yeah be careful beyond that door lies a completely different world but don't be afraid don't stop walking because you get all those bonuses and it's not like you're getting hit anyways because yeah, it's a speed run. Yeah, definitely save. Okay. <laughs> I've eaten enough popcorn for now. I need to put it away. Go, Tanil, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody cheer him on. Yeah. Because it's about to get hard. I'm about to get my butt handed to me. I mean, not necessarily right now. But before we leave this area, Before you go through that door, you might want to set potions to a shortcut. Yeah. Kick those wiggly things butts. Oh shoot. is already set to potion. Reload that and items. Nope, oh, we already got three. Do we All have right. any armor or anything? No. no. Okay. All right. Go, go, go. Whew. Time for a boss battle. Yep.
Time to defeat the Twilight Thorn. That's what it's called, right? Yep. You know, you know, just hanging out. Come on, buddy. All right, there we go. Come on. All right, now that all the flashy stuff's out of the way, the real battle can begin. Good luck. Thanks. I'm gonna need it. Watch out! Okay. Oh, oh god. Heal. a little bit more to yep. get up to his face. There we go. Alright, pretty good so far. And back to this. I feel all of this does still damage this guy as well. Mm hmm. So you could technically kill him in the middle of this. Yeah. I know when speedrunners do this, they want to kill him before he ever does this whole thing again because it's so long. Yeah. Gotcha. And thunk. It's gotta hurt. Yeah. I mean, it's stained glass we're falling on. There you go. Boom! HP increased and you learned guard. Wonderful! able to fight the first boss. Congratulations. Thank you. You got two and a half minutes left. We'll see if we can get to another save point. <laughs> well, we'll probably go until we get to another save point. Yeah. Depending on what the next... I think we'll start off in the usual spot. Thank you! Yeah, let's all congratulate Tennille because he beat the bad guy. I did. That boss can kick your ass mm -hmm. because... You can't train before this. There's not really grinding available. Yeah. Technically, there is oh, that room right before it. Right? You can, like, run around in it a few times, yeah. but... Yeah. It's like you can grind, but, it, yeah, it's a little bit of a roundabout to do mm -hmm. it. You could probably do, like, the first... Struggle match? Mm-hmm. All right. Because the timer hasn't gone off yet. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I gotta go read the rules. Oh, I also have guard. Yes, please. 
Guard is great. Please and thank you. You know, while you're doing this, I think I might actually set up the next poll. Start get the next poll. Yeah. All right. Painter, it's time to go down. I just beat Twilight Thorn. You don't stand a chance, bud. You don't stand a chance, khakis. All right, you got a good first few hits in. I'll I'll give you that. Tamil, do not lose to Hainer. <laughs> To kneel. To kneel. He was just coming and swinging. You have block. Yeah, but like, I couldn't hit him. Luckily, it never happened. Nope, you gotta do it again. Man, weird. You just kind of blacked out there for a moment. This is a list. Yeah? Mm hmm Oh, come on. <coughs> Are you dying, son? Nah, I'm fine. Perfectly fine. Yeah, that's why you're at one hit away from death Shh. as I look over. It's fine, I beat him. And the winner is Good job! Thanks! Yeah, screw you, Hainer. Wow, this is a list. <laughs> I can't believe it. You didn't teach me shit. I had a lot of fun fighting you. Yeah, well, I didn't, wise guy. Hey, let's find a way to cheer you up. Nah, that's all right. Out of the way. You in a rush to lose? <laughs> I'm just letting this play out. Don't mess with your elders. Ooh, just look, those sparks fly. I guess Cypher didn't expect to fight one of his own boys. I like how everyone's like, congratulations, and then you just when did get, get destroyed. <laughs> I don't get destroyed. Yes, he did. No, it didn't happen. <sighs> no such thing happened. I'm not sure what just happened. 
Um, but the PV committed a murder. PV just killed a man. Decimated. Proving once and for all. Final Fantasy IX is better than eight. <laughs> I guess. Well, anyways, I'm ready for the vote now. Yeah. So as soon as this cutscene's over, it looks like Cypher's withdrawn from the struggle. For we will go place. ahead and do that. So I'm in third now. Oh, Hater, you're still losing. <laughs> I enjoy making fun of Hater. He's a dweebus. He is a dweebus. <laughs> okay. All right. We'll just leave it on that because it's time for the harvest vote, and the harvest vote this time is Untitled Goose Game for the Switch, Dishonored <laughs> Definitive Edition for the PlayStation 4, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker for the Wii U, Something Called Solomon's Key for the NES from Switch Online, and The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past, one of my least favorite Zelda games for <laughs> the SNES on the Wii U. So, get to it. And choose our fate. Because <laughs> I am... Well, the chat votes, I am going to run to the bathroom. Oh, Happy well, voting, okay. chat. Okay, never mind. It's chosen. Oh, oh, my clockwork just donated a thousand bits and has chosen uh, Untitled Goose Game. Hell yeah! <laughs> good, good. I, I had a feeling, but good. Mm-hmm. It is a good game. It's a fantastic game. Thank you, One Like Clockwork, for those 1,000 bits. My goodness. So, uh, don't bother voting. Uh, we're playing Untitled Goose Game. Uh, so, yeah. Here's 10 bucks to be a chaotic goose for my entertainment. Well, we can do that. Oh, isn't there two-player for that now? There's DLC to make it two-player. Ooh, is that free DLC, or is that paid? Even if it's paid, I think it's only like a couple bucks. So we can be chaotic geese together, and I'm excited about that. Alright, so, we're going to take a break. And uh, we will be back in a little bit with Untitled Goose Game. See you in a bit.
Okay. Hello, everyone. It's time for Untitled Do Goose Game. Goose Game. We played this on our own time. Yes, we did. And it was a ton of fun. Uh huh. But now there's two player, and it's free, so we have it. Oh. And now we're gonna play two player. Oh, I didn't know about the two player. Yes. Oh. A second goose is available. Oh, wonderful! I'll just talk the whole time. Okay. That works. You're player one, so. Oh. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, we could do a, fr uh, yeah, yeah. Technically, we could do the other game and like try to fill out some more of the things we haven't done. But but honestly, who knows? I, like... I mean, I doubt it. But there might be some people who aren't familiar with this game. So. So I am the more red one with the the bigger bill. Yeah. This one. Hmm. That's interesting. I'm big. Big goose. I have a boo. 
I have a boot. Well, if you have a boot, I have a can. Beautiful. <laughs> We're beautiful. Art. Yes. Ball, 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 ball. You got to bend down. Oh, of course. Because you got a long neck. And long necky. Boop. Yeah. Oh. Nothing can stop us. <laughs> oh. oh, that's probably fine. Yeah. <laughs> Untitled Geese Game! <laughs> because there's two of us. I love that. The minimalism of this game is just really amazing. Like, the point of this game is you're a goose, or two geese, and you just cause havoc. That's it. Can I interact with this? No? Okay. Alright, our to-do list. Controls. Seems pretty straightforward. Uh-huh. And we... To do. Get into the garden. Get the gatekeeper's gatekeeper wet. Steal the groundskeeper's keys. Make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat. Rake in the lake. Have a picnic. Bring to the picnic. Blanket, a sandwich, an apple, pumpkin, carrot, jam, thermos, radio, and basket. Let me in! Let me in! Oh, perfect. A basket. Oh, you killed the radio. A nice little picnic. Oh, right there. Yes. Wonderful. My sandwich now. Oh, oh. I got my neck stuck. Don't do that. Apple. <laughs> Perfect. High five. High wing. Come oh, here. Yeah. High, high wing. Bring yeah. it in. Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this bag. It floats here now. Oh. I hope that's not like fertilizer and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Oh, gate's open. Gotta help them out. Yeah, we're helpful geese. Look! See, aren't you impressed? Hey, what, 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 what? I don't think he likes us. Look, I'm helpful. Come over here. I can't do things unless I We're I can closer. See. Ah, 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 ah! Oh god! Ah! Ah! <gasps> you got the keys! Run! <laughs> Quick! <laughs> Out the gate! Oh no! No! no. Hmm. 
No! <laughs> Give it a key. Who's harassing this man? <laughs> okay, we need to leave him alone for a little bit. Oh, I can only go so far away from you. Go, go, go! Out the gate! Out the gate! Out the gate! Go, go, go! Oh, you're up against the wall. No! Yeah! No, no, no! No, no, no! Go, go back in! Shut the gate! Go back in! Shut the gate! I'm distracting him! Shut! Yeah! No, wait, he has the keys. Yeah, you need to lock it. Well, we need to take the keys so he doesn't have the keys. No passage, sir! Ah, 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 ah! Stop it! Don't hit me, sir. I'm just a little goose. Oh no, he's going for his radio! Yeah, I noticed that. Go, go, go! Oh, I'm stuck! Run, run! Ah! Run, run! Quick! Side entrance! Quick, quick, get the keys, get the keys, get the keys. Damn it! Ah! <laughs> Damn it, man! We're just trying to mess with you. As a goose would. <laughs> this poor man doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Go, this way. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh no. Shit, no! Don't drop it! <laughs> We're not gonna get anywhere, we're just bothering this man. I mean, I'm okay man. with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. No. <laughs> yes. Now he's locked out. Now what are you going to do, buddy? Because the gate is locked, sir. <laughs> Alright, what other havoc can we wreak while we're here? We can take his boot. enough we need this thermos for our picnic and a pumpkin do you want to grab a pumpkin oh we need a pumpkin yeah the rake also needs to go in the lake all right so i think we need to let the dude back in now yeah uh, waddle my way through the bushes That. Worry, he's messing up our picnic. Where is he? Oh, there he is. <laughs> no radio. Hey. You leave that perfectly broken radio alone. It's ours. We've claimed it. Dude, why didn't you open the gate? Oh, we're too far away from each other. Yeah, come over here. I'm going to get the radio. So 
So, oh yeah, that was one of the special bonus missions. missions is locking him out. Uh, make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat. Did we set a timer, by the way? Yeah. Um, you know. No. Ha! <laughs> How long have we been playing? I don't know. Ten minutes. Sure. Set a timer for twenty minutes. All right. Uh. Oh, he grabbed his thermos. How dare he? Right. It's our lovely picnic. Uh, I need you to come this way. Oh, yeah. Hey! I need you to come this way. I'm trying. There we go. All right. Yeah, rake in the lake. <laughs> oh, I love this game. It's so simple. Perfect chaos and incredibly charming. Later. All right, we need to make him do some garden work. I'm a helpful goose. We gotta steal his hat. And I feel like we can do that if he bends over to like plant this flower maybe yeah or pick something up haha -ha! dispose of it yeah, and hide it yep I'm working on it goodbye hat what hat? I don't know of any hats. What else do we need to do? Uh, oh, we Pumpkin, need a carrot. Pumpkin, carrot, and jam. Jam? How are we supposed to get the jam off the table? Can't we reach it? Yeah, oh, you can we just can. reach it. Okay. I'll grab a carrot. He don't even know what hit him. He'll never see it coming. Now we just need a pumpkin. Oh, he's going for his hat. Quick, Ooh. quick, 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 quick. You taking the flower too? Yeah. Wiggle my butt, wiggle my butt. Now it's a nice romantic picnic. Hey, he also wear, is wearing his hat. Oh. Oh. Very simple, just... Hold up. 
Oh. What? Nothing. <laughs> Are you okay? What happened? I think a man died. <laughs> ah! Yeah. Okay, fine, fine. I'm not here. It's fine, bud. I love how he thinks What's that up? putting up a no goose sign is going to get rid of us. Screw your sign! <laughs> All right, let's let's move on. All right. All right. My hammer. My hammer. My hammer. Ah! <laughs> Run! <laughs> yeah! Wee! Oh, cool, toy plane. Okay. Go, go, go. Hit that what hit that switch. Hit that switch. Oh, 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 this switch. Right? Yep. That switch. Ah, dang it. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yeah! It's Goose TV! Can we do double goose? Double goose! Double goose! Double goose! Yes! Yeah! <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah. Which merchandise is more important, lady? This will be fun. This will be fun. Hey, that's Yellow, fine. do you read? Yellow, do you read? Yes. <laughs> How are you over there? Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
implanted the device! Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> uh oh, run for it! Ah, we got the precious goods. No, no, stop, stop squeaking! I wanna, I wanna take this kid's shoelaces. <laughs> so mean. I mean, that's what the game is. Oh. Sometimes you just want to be the ripest asshole. stuff, right? Ah! There's a way for us to open this, isn't there? That's the way forward. Is we it? have to do more stuff in this area. Okay. What is our, what is our objective? Ah! Sir? Okay. Break the broom. Make the boy wear the wrong glasses. I'm taking up the glasses now. Okay. Make someone buy back their own stuff, which should happen soon. Fill the basket with the toothbrush. Lou paper. Hairbrush. Tinned food. Cleaner. Fruit and veg. All right. Oops. You're good. <laughs> there. All right. Um, I don't know where the lady is. I think she went to go pick up the trash. So this is perfect. Oh. She's where back. She How do we break the broom? I forget. Oh, I know how to do it. We have to fight her over the broom. Oh, yeah. Come on, lady. Come on, lady. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, there. That's how we do it. Perfect. Does the cleaner need to be in there too? I think so. Oh, yes. Cleaner. Yeah, we need tin food, fruit and veg. So the veg is over here. Oh, does that count? Does the apple core count as a fruit? Oh, uh, you know, I don't know. You should grab it to find out. Steer clear of this lady. Yeah. Don't knock the loo paper out. <gasps> you leave our basket alone. Uh, it's so heavy. Take 
take the loo paper. It's the last thing we'll put in there. Stop honking! Sorry! No! No, our basket! You bitch! That's right. Go okay, back. Okay, 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 okay. Why? Oh, no, I'm re I can't move any further. Ah! Come with me. Come with me. With you? Yes. I want to pull this farther away. Oh, God. No. It's too heavy. I can't move it. I know. It's best to just get her away from stuff. Can't put it way over here. Uh, it does count as a fruit. So we need the tinned Tin veggies. Food. Food. There, any of that, just grab it, go. Ah, being chased around. Where'd she put the toilet paper? Where'd she uh, drop it? Uh, it's, it's way over All here. Right. All right, go, go, quick, go, quick, go, go. Quick, 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 quick. Yay! Perfect. Yes! Yes! Um, trap the shopkeeper in the garage. We well, we still the... need somebody to. Oh, we need the boy to buy back his airplane. Yeah, he didn't do that. I don't think we're gonna get him to do it at this point. You're just gonna scare him. I don't think we can get him over here. It's gonna take some coercing. We should move on to see, see what else is available. Okay. Alright. Now let's let her be for a little Never. bit. We have to let her be so we can move on. I'm not around. No, what? What? Someone's throwing stuff. <laughs> Okay. Now we leave her be. No geese! Yeah, you go get your broom. You go get your broom. Coward, you won't. You won't. <laughs> you did. Oh, this game is amazing. It's a delight. It's very cheap, and I suggest anyone that has not picked it up to pick it up. It's yeah. good. It's just a good, fun time. Mm-hmm. And coming back to it's fun, too. Mm-hmm. Because it's been a while since we've played it. Yeah. And now there's even more to do. Like play two-player. Exactly. That's what I mean. I get the feeling we go this way. Do 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 do. Naruto run, Naruto run. <laughs> get hacked, boards. Let's play some rugby or whatever. Cricket. Yeah, that one. Throw it. Ah! I'll hit it. Run! Yeah. Run! Make my way past first, second, <clears throat> third, and into home. That's how cricket works, right? Something it's like, like that. baseball. Oh, what a damn shame. 
Do, 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 do. Oh. oh, there's the timer. Yeah. Oh, I am an artiste. Alright, alright, alright. There we go. Yes, hello, is this? I don't know. I just found it laying there. Oh. <laughs> Madame, would you like your brush back? I found it. Oh, God. Oh, just stand there. Just stand yep. there. <laughs> Crazy about those wind chimes, though. nothing. Don't look at me. I'm just a, I'm just a normal little zikibidi boop bop bop. Oh no, she realized. No! Uh. Alright, so... Uh -oh. uh oh, oh, I got pushed through the wall. Um... <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Alright, well, this we is should, where we, we stop. Finish. So, you can cheese her out and get her to put the ribbon on you instead of her silly duck thing. It's quite abusing. <sighs> but that's gonna be it for this game. Yeah, what a, what a good fun game, though. This is a good one. <laughs> I enjoy wreaking havoc with you, Sean. Yes, that was a good time. Oh, did I die? Honk to get the camera's attention. Well, that's interesting. Cute. All right. It's time for the next game. Yes. Which means we need to vote on the next game. I forgot that we're not on break. <laughs> yeah, no break here. It's just the, the, the goose game is so quiet. Because, mm -hmm. you know, we're not doing anything. Normally the music plays when you do stuff. But, oh, I hope everyone had good holidays. And, I mean, holidays are still happening. Not everybody celebrates uh, Christmas or on the day of Christmas. And then, of course... We still got New Year's and all that. Oh, uh, yeah. Could just be because I'm a night owl. I always like New Year's. Well, yeah, because we're always up that late anyways. Oh, yeah, totally. But, like, I don't necessarily, like, do anything for New Year's. I just, like, you know... Hanging out with people until midnight. It's fun. Celebrating the new year. All right. And, oh my goodness. Oh, I have a feeling I know what's going to win. I mean, I do too, but I don't know for sure. Yeah. there. Oh, 
I'm going to interact with chat more directly, but when Sean's doing this, I can't see the chat, so... I mean, you could always pull the chat up on... True. Okay. Honk, 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 honk. All right, anyways. Here's the straw poll, and I should, I guess, actually tell you what's on the straw poll yes. by showing you, because it's River City Ransom for the NES, One Shot for the PC, a game we were gifted and I have not played it, XCOM Enemy Unknown, which is like a strategy shooty game where you fight aliens, Double Dragon 2, The Revenge for the NES, which is like a beat-em-up, I think, which is also River City Ransom, and Papers, Please, for the PC. So now you can vote and decide what game you would like to see us play next. What are the results like? Oh my! It's about what I expected. It's currently a race between uh, One Shot and Papers, Please. Ooh. They're tied, Ooh. in fact. It's getting spicy. Honestly, those are the two games I'm the most interested in. I don't remember what One Shot is. Well, I've never seen it. That's why I don't know what it is, but... Oh, uh, is it, it was, one that was gifted to us? Yeah, Tusk gifted it to us. Oh, that's right! And Papers, Please was given to us by Tom. And I yes. know Papers, Please is a good game, but I have no idea what One Shot is. Speaking of which, One Shot is now definitely winning. But if people continue to vote, they could change it. An absolute nerd says, one shot is great. All right, I'm going to give it a minute to see if anybody will knock this out. But currently, one shot is winning. Hmm. Man, this game's really quiet, so, like, nothing's happening. Uh-huh. That's how it be sometimes. I think we're going to go ahead and call it. One Shot is the next game we play, and I didn't download that one. <laughs> so you'll have to download that one on the break. Yes. So I I believe it's an indie game, so it shouldn't be terribly large. But if there's some buffering that happens, that's, that's why. It's because we're downloading a game. Yeah. So when we come back, One Shot. Awesome. See you in a bit.
Okay, and Hello. we're back. Time for us to play some one shot. Will there be any new characters in Clouded Moon, Moon in the future? Yes. There's a lot of characters that you guys haven't been introduced to yet. Okay, so click on that. All right. Let's start. Set a timer. Set a timer for 30 minutes. Dedicated to our beloved friend Felix, the judge. We miss you. Oh. Hmm. You know, I wonder if I can get the plug, controller working again. Plug in the controller again. Yeah. Because it looks like this might work better as a controller game. I don't know anything about this game, but same. The it tags, looks cute. the tags on the Twitches said mm -hmm. that it was like a puzzle platformer. Okay. Oops. Well, I don't know. I pressed a button and it went to the next screen, so All it's right. working. Explore. Explore and interact with the environment and characters. Sometimes you may find an item. Once you've picked up an item, you may select it from your inventory. When the item is active, you can either combine it with other items in the inventory or use it at certain locations in order to progress. Oh, is this more like a point and click a bit? It might be. Although full screen is an option, the game is best experienced in windowed mode. Closing the game will save your progress. This game also autosaves after some key events. Okay. Hello? It's me. Well, if it wants me in not full screen mode. Oh, oh dear. Alright, hold on. I would appreciate it if you kept it full screen so that I can see it. Okay. Is it too small for you? Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll go back to full screen then. Yeah. I, I I remember when people were talking about this before that it uh, messes with your like backgrounds and stuff, or like your the background of your computer. Oh. And it requires you to open up files. Oh. Well, okay. That might be a thing then. No. Dusty, Dusty books. books. Too dark to read in here. Nico. Bathroom. Withered plants sit here, stiff and dry. A branch snaps off. All right, now we have a branch. Those can't be combined. A pair of luminous yellow eyes stares back at Nico. No water in the toilet. The tub won't run. Hmm. We don't have plumbing. Oh. Door is locked. In the faint light, Nico can glimpse the face of the remote. All the numbers except 7185 are missing. They're marked in bright colors. Okay then. Oh, I did that in the wrong color combination, didn't I? Okay, seven is red, one is blue. Eight, yellow, five, green. Okay, you remember those last two. I'll remember the first two. Red, seven. Okay. Five is green, eight is yellow. Da, okay. You found me. 
Why? You're already too late. Not much of the world remains. This will be apparent once you go outside. This place was never worth saving. Do you still want to try? Then remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to help Nico leave. And most importantly... Ah! You have one shot, Tenille. Oh, no! Oh, it, it's like an extra window. Okay. Oh, all right. I think we gotta leave it in windowed mode then. Okay, well then, hold on. Now, can you, uh... Would it be important then to also make your desktop visible? Uh, it might be. I got a lot of stuff on my desktop. Uh, how about we worry about that if... If it, it comes up? If it comes up. Okay. All right, there we go. I, I love this trend of games breaking, breaking the fourth wall. Yes. Like, like really, like breaking the fourth wall by interacting with your computer and stuff. Mm -hmm. That is really cool. Nico, here's a sound at the door. Of the, oh, sounds, here's a sound of the door unlocking. Hello? Hello? Right. Anyone? TV gives off a dangerous looking spark. Nico readies the branch. It doesn't manage to light. Ah. I thought I was being smart. The wood in the fireplace looks like it was never used. Perhaps it could be lit. It's a bit spooky. Inside the refrigerator is a bottle of alcohol. Just a table. The sink won't turn on. No, we don't have any plumbing. Nico dips the branch into the alcohol. So now we have a wet branch. I got this. I got this. I know what we're doing. Ah! Now we got burning stick. Perfect. It's glowy. I I'm trying to touch it. Uh, I think he need to go up one. Stand on top of it? Ah, something on the ground glimmers in the firelight. It appears to be a small metallic object wedged into a crack in the floor. Nico digs it out. I thought we were like a cat. A cat person. Yeah. Uh, basement key. Okay. We also have an empty bottle. Hmm. With a name like Nico. Stick got stick. Bitches love sticks. Stick stick <laughs> stick 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 stick. Loo, stick. Loo. Big stick, little stick, other stick. Becky. Oh, I guess I unlocked the basement already. A light bulb. Hmm. A large light bulb. It's the sun. Wonderful! Oh, this is making me uneasy. By the way, I don't think we told you guys, but this is probably going to be the last game of the stream. Oh, yeah. What's left of a computer terminal? Yeah, this place is all hecked up.
Fast, fast travel. travel. You can quickly travel to the locations you've already visited by selecting the fast travel option in the menu. The default key for opening the menu is A. Fast travel cannot be used indoors. So where did we come from? The Baron's entrance. So like that train car? I think so. What's left of a robot? I have a feeling this game was made in Game Maker. Which is not a bad thing. Yeah. Kind of looking around, seeing if there's anything interesting to interact with at all. Uh, loading zone? I guess so. Oh, hi there. Um, hello? Um, hello? Hmm. I'm very intrigued. Oh. Broken off section of railing. Nico takes it. We got metal stick. Got stick. Got stick. This bed probably looks familiar to you, Daniil. Nico first woke up in the world here. It's important that you allow Nico to sleep once in a while. The game will exist automatically. Exit. Exit automatically and can be continued later. Don't be alarmed. But there's no need to rest now. So the reason it's saying to Neil is because the name of this computer thinks the login is to Neil. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, it's spooky. It knows our information. Okay, we can't go that way. Pizza time! Oh, pizza time. Hmm, pizza. Hmm. Granted, we're gonna have shepherd's pie tonight, so that is also 10 out of 10 delish. But maybe we'll have to eat some pizza soon. Hey, bud. Do you want stick? I mean, bottle? Can I hit you with stick? No? Just okay. Whack! Wake know. up! It doesn't seem to be it. working. It's mac and cheese for me tonight, says one like clockwork. Mm. It's been a while since we've had that. Yeah. We haven't been getting 2% milk, though. That's true. And mac and cheese is really best with 2% milk. It doesn't taste as good with uh, soy milk, that's for sure. Almond milk. Almond milk. It actually would probably be fine, like, better with soy, but the, the nuttiness of the almond and mac and cheese just, like, doesn't mix very well. IMO. Now the robot... Oh, and mm -hmm. that pool doesn't have anything in it. Oh! Ah! Uh, that light bulb, you are here. M me Yes. Welcome to our world, friend. I am most humbled by your presence, yes. Uh, thanks. Sorry, I'm a little lost. Ah, right. Allow me to explain some things. May I first ask how you arrived here? I'm not sure. I woke up in this weird house. 
It was really dark. Oh, so you woke up in an unfamiliar dark location? Mm-hmm. Just as my prophecy foretold, yes. <laughs> you are the savior we have been waiting for. You will be the one to save our world from eternal darkness. Um. I will now provide you with vital information. Please ask me anything. Oh, well. Can you tell me about... This world, the light bulb, the computer, going home. Let's start at the top. I'm not sure where I am exactly. I can't see too far off. Everything's so dark. Our world has not always been this dim, nor was it so broken. But time waits for nobody, not even saviors. The world is divided into three regions. You're on the fringe right now, the Barrens. That tower you see in the distance once held our sun. Oh, so that's what the tall thing was. As you go further towards the center, you will cross the outer regions. There should be a map still in this outpost somewhere. Ooh. Can you tell me about... The light bulb. I found it in the house I woke up in. Within your hands is our new son. Your son? Yes. Years ago, our previous son sat atop that tower and spilled its life into the land. But one day, the light went out. Oh. The world is still hanging on by a thread. The surface of this world is abundant with element called phosphor. Fortunately for us, this element stored light energy from our previous sun. It's now our only source of illumination, but its energy is finite. When the last of us, last of the light dies out, our world will too. Ah. Uh. But now that you are here with the new sun, all is well. You will need to restore it to the tower. That looks pretty far off. Yes, so begins your pilgrimage. Oh, no, dude, we're already on one pilgrimage. We can't do another one. <laughs> Not at the same time. <laughs> also, the sun is fragile, so be careful. If the sun shatters, the world will end in an instant. Oh. Can you tell me about... I don't like the idea of shattering. The That's computer. So violent. In the house, I found this computer... It kept saying stuff like, your actions here will affect Nico, but I'm Nico. Are those messages meant for someone else? Hmm. If I had to guess, they might be trying to pass the message to Tenniel. Tenniel? Ah, uh, that would be our god. <laughs> if you are here, that means Tenniel is here also. Tenniel will provide guidance for your journey. <laughs> In fact, they already have. Really? I haven't seen anyone, though. Very meta. Okay. I love it. Have you not contacted Tenille yet? I don't think so. Being the bringer of our son, you have the sacred ability to communicate directly with Tenille. An ability that no one else possesses, certainly not I. Please close your eyes and focus. All right. Hello? Tenille? Are you there? So, that is not my name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. Nice to meet you, Tenille. My name is Nico. Hi. I actually heard someone. They said their name is Tenille. This is incredible. Do not be afraid to ask Tenille for assistance. You are the Messiah, after all. Oh, can you tell me about going home. Uh, I don't mean to be rude, but I, I'm not sure about this. I still don't know how I got here. I was just with my mama a few hours ago, and now it feels like I'm in a bad dream. I just want to go home. Your mission is to save our world, just as my mission is to tell you about our world. I am unable to help you beyond my programming. I am sorry. Oh, I think that's all I have to ask for now. Excellent. I wish you luck. Well, you said something about a map in here. It won't turn on. That seems important. This pipe won't fit under the cracks, Tenille. We need to flatten it somehow. What? The pipe you have. 
This box looks interesting. I wish I had something to pry it open with. Okay. An empty bottle. One, a robot may not injure a living person or through inaction allow a person. Okay, we're going... Oh, it's the law of robotics. Yeah, the three laws of robotics. A robot must obey the orders given to it by people except where such orders would conflict with the first law. A robot must protect its own existence as long as the such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Uh, what is the guy that... It's not Newton. Who made up the laws of yeah, robotics? Yeah, it's... Give me a second, I'll look it up. Blank's Laws of Robotics. I don't remember the guy's name. Oh, it's a map. We're currently in the Barrens, and then there's a lake, and then we get to the Glen, and then Refuse. Maslow? Maslow? Kazuyoshi is saying? Isaac uh, Asimov? Isaac Asimov. Asimov, yes, that's the term. Three Laws of Robotics. Yes. Anyways, look. Map. So it really is a ring. Yep. Asimov's Three Laws of Robotics. The use of a robot as our replacement head engineer seems unorthodox, especially the one responsible for last year's incident. I suppose they had to get her away from the city, but that doesn't make it easier to swallow for those of us who work here. I hope that man knows what he's doing. He's doing management it's a food faded poster reminder to all workers the rarest form of blue phosphor is found during the phosphor shrimps spawn period if you observe a pond with a bubbled over surface please contact management immediately we will dispatch a harvest team ASAP hmm not sure what that means. Faded poster. Five new positions available at the mines. Housing and other provisions are included upon hiring. First come, first serve. Well, Maslow was the dude who did the hierarchy of needs. Yes. Do you know about that one, Sean? Mm, You'll I probably might. recognize it once you see it. Probably. A page with faded ink. Able to provide power to all robots and machinery in the area via a large electromagnetic field. Maintenance efforts are quite high as expected. We have provided customized backup cells for the few most important robots. Their electromagnetic fields are much weaker and the signals are highly specific. In other words, these small cells can only charge one single... The rest is unreadable. So I bet I need one of those to power up the robot. There are lots of small glowing shrimp swimming in the jar. Some, Some sort of small machine. Wonder what it does. I can feel my hair standing up a little. I want to beat it. No. No violence. Big machine doesn't seem to do anything. There's a rectangle shaped hole in the middle. Something used to fit in here. Mm -hmm. yeah, um, Maslow's hierarchy of needs is the like, you start at the base and once like those needs, it's the idea of like, you need to have these needs met. Like your physiological Air, needs. water, food, shelter, sleep, clothing, reproduction. And then you can get to safety, which is personal security, employment, resources, health, property. Then love and belonging, which is friendship, intimacy, family, sense of connection. And then esteem is respect, self-esteem, status, recognition, strength, freedom. And then at the very top is self-actualization, desire to become the most one can be. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm assuming it's something along the lines of if you don't take care of all of those things. The if other you're parts. missing something of like in a lower tier, essentially, of your of your needs, it you can't really... It's hard, it's much more difficult or impossible to take care of the higher needs. Right. Uh, 
Well, either way, we get to run around and keep looking at stuff. Man, I love puzzle games. I mean, I honestly do enjoy puzzle games to some extent. I, I love puzzle games. School do be making it very difficult to follow those needs. Yeah! It's like school sucks or something. I've noticed that interactable objects have more often than not been a different color. <gasps> ooh, 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 ooh. Uh-huh. Oh! Oh, do you want me to crash the pipe in here, Tennille? Oh, but I don't want to get too close. Oh, that was scary. Now we have a crowbar. Hell yeah! Yeah, mostly, most of the interactable objects I've seen so far have been, uh, wait, hold on, uh, travel to outpost? Oh, is that where I already am? I guess so. It was in here, right? Yeah. Yes. Government's not doing a great job either? Nope. Yeah. Oh, this bar should open it. There's a little metal cube and some broken glass in here. Looks like what used to be a machine part. It says solar battery on the side. Broken battery. Hmm. Tenille, I'm not gonna smash the sun. Ha 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 That was completely unintentional, by the way. I did not mean to do that. Smash the sun! Okay, so we have this battery. Real question, what can we do with it? Nothing happened. Okay, so, so we, we need gotta to find a way to turn the machine it. on. Yeah. We need to charge the battery so it turns on. Yeah. Feels like we should be able to use our little sun to do that, but. Like, it even says, I think we're on the right track, but it yeah. won't let me do it. Mm hmm. miss anything. This game's very pretty, though. Yeah. And intriguing. I'm Marty invested. Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh, a note. It's perfect. Although the poisonous gas is highly localized to the vent zones, barren workers were still recommended to wear gas masks. These masks were mandatory around active vent sites, of course. As more and more of the workforce got replaced by robots, we found ourselves with a surplus of abandoned gas masks. It seemed like a waste to get rid of them all, so we kept a few for emergencies. Cool, where are they? Yeah, I think we should have one of those. Seems important. Seems like we might need one of those. A very long, windy path. Indeed. Ah, a note. Hmm.
Nope, plucks. What's that? The sun will not return and the abyss is calling my name. I'm sorry, everyone, for choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. Mm. Oh. Whoa. That's our timer. Okay. Well, I would like to do... I, 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 to figure well, out I at least like the next should... piece of the puzzle. Yeah, we should at least... Get something done. The metal safe seems like it's locked with a six digit code. I don't remember seeing any six digit codes, do you, Tennille? Mm, that wasn't it. You can always try. But. But. What a note to end on, says one like clockwork. <laughs> A torn page with faded ink. XX, XX, XX. With the mining operations going smoothly, materials are no longer our limiting factor. We will be able to build more resilient robots, both in body and mind. Specifically, the discovery of metal alloy 291 will likely allow the development of highly efficient circuitry. Hmm. <laughs> Kazuyoshi says 123456. That might just be it, by God. Will we be playing more of this game? I think so, but I'm thinking it might only come up on Harvest streams. Yeah. Like, I think this game is intriguing, but I don't want to just play more of it on our own time. Yeah, well, and I think this is the perfect kind of game to do a blind playthrough of. Mm-hmm. A robot. No power, just like the rest. So this is a perfect game to just continue playing whenever it comes back up on Harvest Stream. Absolutely. Ah! The light bulb. So, are you the Messiah? Well, that's what I've been told. I expected someone taller. Or at least someone that doesn't look like a kitten. That's what you are, right? Some sort of cat? Uh-huh. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh! I'm a person! You've got the eyes of a cat. But cats walk on four legs! Well, either way. A child like you being the messiah just doesn't feel right. But that robot back there says there's no mistake. I know. <sighs> this is gonna be a going to sound cold, but I honestly think you're better off just leaving and letting the world die naturally. The world has been falling apart for a long time. This manner of decay, it's highly improbable that the sun can fix it. You already seen how bad it can get, right? We haven't seen much of anything, actually. And I can't really just leave. Oh, so you just got here? Then you must be headed towards the tower. Mm-hmm. That's where I'm supposed to put the light bulb. Uh, sun, isn't it? Yes, at the very top. We know that the tower contains a force that nobody could comprehend. And the power is strongest at the summit. Maybe it'll send you back home after you complete your mission. Oh! Don't take my word for it, though. Interesting. Dear Silver, I heard the news about the mines. I'm sorry. I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. I know it must be hard, but maybe it's better that you came back. It's only a matter of time before the robots are recalled. At least let me know if you got my message, okay? Kip. Hmm. Silver and Kip. Something happened. Please do not touch that. Oh! Uh, sorry. I got curious. What is this thing? Backup power cell. Keeps me functional. The main generator for the Barons ran out of power some time ago. Couldn't... It could not even last a week without the sun. Sorry to hear that. 
All we can do is make use of the light we have. Hello, Sparkly. Something's poking out of the shelf. Ah, it's a screwdriver. You can take it if you want. It may help you. Oh, are you sure? Yeah, I've got lots. Thank you! We now have a screwdriver! Hmm. I haven't played chess with anyone else for a very long time. Oh? Not even with the other robots? No. Nobody in the Barons have the capacity have that capacity in their programming. Nobody here is tamed for that matter. Tamed? A bed. It's made of metal? Doesn't look very comfortable. Alright. Well, I think that's probably a good spot to stop. Yeah, I think so. Let's talk to them one more time. What's inside the tower? I don't know. Nobody's ever entered it before. At least, nobody history knows. Then, who built it? Built? As far as anyone can tell, it's been there since the beginning of time. I know someone who wanted to study it before, but... Hmm. Oh? Uh, he never told me if it went anywhere. Hmm, okay. So... The game said that it just auto-saves, right? Yes. And saves if we close it? It might save if you go back to bed. That too. Is there a bed here? No. Uh, downstairs. What? Oh. Okay. There's a bed. Okay. Yeah. I'm a little tired. Yes. Oh, yeah, the yeah, game and just closes it just out. Exits. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, well let's uh, take it over to this I guess. Yeah. Alright. Neat. That is an interesting game. That is an interesting game, and I think this was an interesting stream. Mm-hmm. I'm Only always played... happy to put more point-and-click adventures on my game list, because <laughs> I, I enjoy point-and-clicks. Yes. They usually are really fun in the story department. Yeah. While we only played four games today, it was still a very good stream. Uh, mm -hmm. It's just we're kind of tired, honestly. Uh, well, after doing the premiere, that was a lot of excitement, so, <laughs> as you can imagine. Yeah. yeah. So, if you guys haven't checked it out, you guys should check out Clouded Moon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Because... <laughs> Tanil worked very hard on that. The whole team worked really hard. With the rest really of his team for the last... Worked really hard on it. A year? Yeah. A year? More? Yeah. Lots of time. Mm-hmm. So it's going to be good. Uh, either way, that's going to be it for this stream. I did notice that we got... <laughs> oh, a couple of gifts. Oh, fun! <laughs> a couple of gifts were given to us during that stream. But people will just have to find out about those on Mailstream next Friday to know exactly what those are because they didn't come up this time. Yeah. And that's okay. Uh, either way, the next uh, the next stream to come up will be Monday, Pokemon Days, mm -hmm. RNG Team Platinum. We're fighting the 8th gym and then probably Victory Road. We're almost done with Platinum. Yeah. But I don't think we're going to beat it this year. So it's going to have to happen next year because we're at the end of the year. Ha 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 jokes uh, about taking a year. <laughs> Platinum <clears throat> took a whole year. <gasps> oh, look at that blue. What? Ice Car Rider has got the blue flower bud. <gasps> oh, you're right. I we haven't like... seen a blue flower bud yet. Has it been that way the whole stream? I just haven't been looking at it. That means they've been subscribed for a long time. Oh my goodness. Hell yeah. That's cool. Also, I think I might have put the colors backwards. I think I have light blue then to dark blue. Oh. Whatever. So what, it goes like yellow blue? Or orange? Or... It goes... It's supposed to be Roy G. Biv, but I think I did... 
Ibv. Ibv. Ice Car Rider says, what? I can't see it. <laughs> it's the flower bud by your name. Look at the stream. It should be there now. Yeah, hopefully. There it is. There it is. Yeah. yeah. That looks really good. I love it. Oh. That's the first one we've seen. That means you've been subscribed longer than anybody else except for the people with the first next to their name. Yeah. Like Tuss. Yeah. And Ray of Sunshine has the first as well. Yeah. Uh... Anyway, Anyways, that's going to be it. I hope you guys Mondays. have a wonderful night. Yes, and then uh, next Friday is going to be the finale of Melody of Memory. Yep. And on top of that... Uh, we need well, to decide what we're doing for the next game to start. Yeah, we do, because that's a week from now. Yeah. We need to figure that out. We might throw some things for people to vote on mm -hmm. in the Patreon. Who knows? <laughs> the sunglasses. <laughs> looks like a nose. <laughs> or it looks like... Looks like a mustache. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's going to be it. Thank you guys for joining us. And Have we a wonderful will, evening. Yeah, we'll see you guys later. Oh, also, I want to say thank you for all the subscriptions and bits that we got. Thank you so much.